Oh my god. <laughs> what is this? So the penis pic in this episode, again, was inspired by a time that I received such a picture on my phone. I was having a professional lunch on New Year's Day and received an email from someone who I hadn't seen in like months and whose penis I definitely hadn't seen in like longer than months. Adam just texted that to me. I have no words. I loved this idea of sort of the lines people draw in the sands. The coworkers see a very clear division between a boss touching your butt and your boyfriend sending you a dick pic. So Damn. disrespectful. You need to leave him. Here, you get away from me. You need to break up with this guy on the immediate. Thank you. This on is the ridiculous. Immediate. But we put up with Rich touching our butts all the time. That's different. a hella different. To them, it's like, it's at work, so it's okay, but if it's in your personal life, then it's disrespectful. What happened to your eyebrows? The thing about Hannah is that she's so susceptible to everyone's advice. I'm gonna do something with them, okay? Yeah, she's okay. gonna make them good. If someone told her, like, you look really great with a pixie cut, like, she'd do anything to her face or her hair. What's up with your eyebrows? I didn't come here to talk about that. The scene where Hannah attempts to break up with Adam, that was sort of one of the most emotional scenes to film. A lot of it was taken from a breakup email that I had written. So that was sort of an amazing experience I never expected to have in this lifetime of actually getting to sort of read and act out sort of a pained breakup letter. I just want someone who wants to hang out all the time and thinks I'm the best person in the world and wants to have sex with only me. Adam sees her more clearly than he ever has. She spent so much time trying not to show him who she is and when she does, they have an actually kind of genuine moment passes between them. When you're in your 20s, sex is sort of the battleground on which a lot of different stuff gets played out. You could touch it if you want. It was really interesting writing the scene where Shoshana attempts to lose her virginity because I love this idea of her getting so close and then it didn't happen. And Zasha was such a champ shooting that scene because even though I've shot a lot of awkward sex scenes, that one was especially painful because of the idea of a character who didn't even really know what sex was or how it worked. Would you have sex with a virgin? He Depends on the virgin. Me. It was really, really fun in this episode to shoot the scene where Charlie and Ray perform. In real life, Chris Abbott plays guitar and sings. Alex Karpovsky had never done anything musical but taught himself to be a body percussionist by watching YouTube. And this is called Hannah's Diary. Charlie and Ray find Hannah's Diary and sort of, that's sort of a, uh, a place where Charlie finds out some of the truth about his relationship with Marnie. Marnie has to stop whining and break up with him already. Of course it'll be painful, but she's already in so much agony, stuck in a prison of his kindness. Her writing isn't making an impact in the world, but she's sort of secretly satisfied it's making an impact in her friend group, even though it's causing massive problems. Okay. Ah! And we close. <laughs>